Hi, this is Krista at The Secret Gardenery. Welcome to our crochet podcast, episode 35. Welcome back to all my returning subscribers and hello if you are new and popping by here for the very first time. My name is Krista. I live in Nairobi, Kenya, although I'm Canadian. I moved here about 17 or 18 years ago. I am married. I have four kids, six dogs, five chickens, two leopard tortoises, and two guinea pigs, and three birds. This channel is all about crochet and crochet related items. We generally do a podcast or I do a podcast once a week and we do a live chat on Fridays. It's Friday morning in the US or 5 p.m. in Nairobi if you wanna just Google what time that would be for you, Friday at five in Nairobi. Uh, we also do some crochet alongs and tutorials and crochet bits. We're also doing a crochet vacay, like a crochet safari holiday in February 2019, yay! Uh, we're doing four days on safari, so seeing the big five, and four days on the beach, relaxing, crocheting, hooking on the Indian Ocean, as you do, and four days in Nairobi, going to my favorite hot spots, feeding giraffes, seeing baby elephants, going to Kazuri Bead Factory, uh, Carnivore Restaurant, River Cafe, all my hot spots, with Kavita, in case you're asking about that. And so that'll be super great. There's information about that uh, on the website, which is secretyarnery.com slash trips. So check that out. If you're interested, we'd love to have you join us. Oh, uh, what else? I think that was my business bits. Finished objects? Mmm, not so much. I don't think I have any finished objects. To be honest with you, I have been working fiendishly on my double daisy granny square blanket which I am absolutely loving I will put a picture of kind of it here I mean I laid it out for motivational sake so that's kind of what it'll look like ish when it's done I'm doing eight where's one I can show you I'm doing eight wide and eight long, so it'll be a square. It's a little, it's about five feet. I, the picture was it stretched over a queen size bed and before the join. So the join is gonna add like at least an inch between each of the squares, of which I did 63 and because I was doing nine by seven, which is too long and too skinny. So eight by eight, I have to do one more. So great for that, not quite done. Joining, not sure how I was joining. In the last podcast, I showed you, I think I did, or maybe it was the live, I'm not sure, but I showed you the joining just with the white. So I've changed that up, and then I was like, let me try with the green. So it'll be kind of like a gardeny blanket. It's just a flat braid join, same as the sand dollar and surf blanket ish. But then I'm like, that just takes away too much of the color. And this is actually like a candy pink. It looks pretty pale in the camera, but it's much more vibrant than that. But anyway, that's what I was thinking. But then I'm... Oh. So then I did a bunch of other joining options. And this is the one we've decided on. So that is a round of single crochet in parchment and then the flat braid join in white. So just a little bit of difference but I think it'll make the border a lot more fun because I wanna do a border in all the colors of the blanket. And if I did the green, it would kinda of limit, well, it would look weird, I don't know, you'd have to incorporate green into the whole thing and that's enough green for me. So we are going with that one. Unless I come up with a genius idea before I start joining, but I only have, where are you at? I have two more ivory borders to put on before I'm done with the, or not ivory, parchment borders to put on before I start doing the white joining, join as you go. So pretty much committed to the join as you go at this point in time, the flat braid join. Yes, I'll be doing a tutorial. I love it. So I'm super excited about that. Uh, and I have to do one more of these. I have to do a yellow one, one more of these yellows. Because yellow is going to be the center of the 
of the center of the blanket, the diagonal, so I need eight. Yeah, I need eight of the yellow and then seven of the rest of the colors. Fine. So working on that, that's my whip, which I'm actively doing and I really enjoy it. That one I like. Um, and that's it, that's all I've been doing. Next, I did my acquisitions, which was my 24 kilos of acrylic, which did arrive, and I have on my sofa behind me, so I will show you that. If I can get up. So this is the Canyon acrylic. This is black, daffodil, chocolate, taupe, red, saffron, parchment, mandarin, boy blue, lime, and charcoal. Extra charcoal, guess why? If you know why, leave it in the comments below. So I left, I left all that out so you can see what 24 kilos looks like. It sounded like a lot, it's actually not that much. So it is going to get put away on these missing spots down here. So that'll get kind of plumped up. Minus a couple colors that come from a different manufacturer which is much more difficult to source. So that's about it for my crochet tidbits today. Um, Kavita is coming for the live on Friday. I think she's bringing that crazy coffee, the, you know, the cat poop one or whatever it is. Ooh. Anyway, we, I think we're trying that. Unless she forgets. And then I have like Moringa tea, which is also supposed to be not that great unless you guys are into Moringa. I don't know, my husband tried it, and he was like, oh, why do you even call that tea? That's not tea. So I'm like, ooh, maybe it's rough. I don't know. Oh, and the giveaway update. Thank you for all your ideas and suggestions. I totally appreciate that. I'm kind of changing the way I'm doing my giveaways. So what I'm gonna do, instead of doing every month uh, a giveaway, and even this summer, my summer one, it's already August anyway, I'm going to be doing a giveaway every 5,000 subscribers. So I hope that helps the channel grow organically with like-minded people that are into crochet and into crochet stuff. On a good note, I, there was a, quite a few um, community members that did find us on the giveaway and then have joined our community since then, so it's a bit of a conundrum. But I think I'm going to do a n nice, big, fat, juicy giveaway every 5,000 subscribers. And that should be every every couple months, every few months, which is still the same as doing one every season or something like that. And I think that would be more rewarding. Well, it would fit, it would keep in line with what I want, which is to reward and connect with you, my subscribers, people who watch the day-to-day, -day, the this, the that, and are part of our community. Um, so that is what we're gonna be doing. We're gonna have a giveaway for 15,000 subscribers. Now, I don't know if we are doing like it, if I start it right when it turns to 15,000 or if we start at 14,000 and end the giveaway when it gets to 15,000, I don't know. I gotta think about that. So if you have any super great ideas, let me know. I know on Holly, the Proper Pineapple channel, she is doing a giveaway for 10,000 subscribers and she's doing 10 small giveaways for 10 days. So that would be really great. Although when you get to 15, 15 days, that's like half a month. That's a lot of giveaways and that is a lot of videos, but it would also be super fun. Hmm. Or maybe five days? Maybe we take the first digit off of it. I don't know what to do. If you have great ideas, Bernadette, help me out, leave it in the comments below. I would love that. So that is what I have for you today. Let me know what you're working on, what you're hooking on, and where you're hooking from. Is it winter for you? Is it summer for you? It is winter time here, 68 degrees inside my house at the moment. I'm not complaining, although I am wearing a sweater and slippers and huddled up, sitting on my feet as usual. But it's actually sunny outside and it's been sunny for a couple days. So the house, it's not, I'm not complaining about the cold. One night I didn't, I'm not saying I didn't need the water bottles in my bed, but I did keep my feet out of the bed because my bed was so hot. So summer's coming back over here. I'm excited about that. It's so nice when it is perfect weather outside. It's so great. So I have a nice big patio set up out there with sofas and everything. 
that way my veranda, the front of the urinary. So I'm looking forward to sitting out there and hooking along. Kids ride their bikes on the driveway and there's the dogs and everything's out there. So it's a really great place. And I love to sit out there. It is so, like you, it's just so relaxing. And it's one of my favorite sofa sets. I love it. Anyway, blah, 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 blah. too much talking, right? So that's it. Can't wait. If I chat with you on Friday, I'm looking forward to it. If I don't chat with you on Friday, then I look forward to hanging out with you again next Wednesday. So have a super great week. Keep up with the foul, everybody. Your finish alongs are great. And we'll chat soon. Stay hooked. So we are going to get potatoes, mangoes, cheese. Okay, first we're going to Diamond Plaza. Diamond Plaza, we're getting potatoes and mangoes. Then we are going to Royal Snacks. We are going to buy cheese. Hot dogs. Then we are going to Care For. We are going to buy what, boys? Bread Hot cereal. dogs. That's right, Jurassic World. What? You and Jurassic World. <laughs> Jurassic World. No, we're not buying Jurassic World, but thank you for the good idea. Oh, there's the Jurassic motorbike. World toy. There's the decked out motorbike. Boom. Studded seat. Very classy. There is spotless. No sign inside. Thank you, Mirror. It is Wednesday, so it is not so busy because yesterday, Tuesdays and Fridays are the busy days for fresh vegetables at City Park. Yes. It is Wednesday, my dude. My Mir, what are you even going on about? Is it lack of test of trip? Hello, Captain. So that's like a taxi stand. You can hire a motorbike. You hang out. Nursery. This is a school on that side, Agacon Academy. It's the primary. It's loud, right? I'm thinking they're gonna get bored of me talking, but apparently not. So that is Agacon Primary. It's a good school. It is old, obviously. And it used to be the whole school, but now it is just the primary, and then secondary is somewhere else. They have a academically it is quite good it's also generally affordable compared to other options and it is american school system they also do ib is that uniforms like that oh. those are my potatoes i need my potatoes yeah, go make them. oh look a pink car it's inter it's individual mirror. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to teach my kids to share their opinion in a non inflammatory way. <laughs> I'm like you can always say something's interesting because it's interesting. Doesn't mean you like it. Yeah. Oliver, ease up, bro. Mom, mom, yes, Anthony. My is, is Your stomach is bleeding. Mom, mom. Huh. Your thumb is bleeding. Oh, you must need a plaster. No, maybe you should. Not. Maybe you should stop putting it in your mouth. He has some dust on his hands. Oh, that's the school bus for your con. But he has a blade on his hands or something. Oh, from your plaster. Yeah. Plaster is British speak for band-aid. Band-aid. They don't call them band-aids here. It's not a plaster. They call it plaster. Could I have a plaster? I don't know what that thing is besides interesting. School uniforms, staff uniforms, interesting. <sighs> That's charcoal in those bags there, so burnt and buried trees. I don't think banana trees turn into charcoal. Yeah, I don't think so.
this used to be the rusty car. So they had a rusty car sitting here forever and no street signs. So it would be turn at the rusty car. But now it's just charcoal and there is no rusty car. And there's street signs. Yes, we're almost there, sweetie. And if you turn that way, somewhere over there, in and around, is Kavita's neighborhood. Hi, Kavita. So we're going to Diamond Plaza two, but Diamond Plaza one first. Oh look, window cleaner. That's I modern. Get out of the car and stay inside. You do you want to get out of the car or you want to stay inside? stay inside? Depends where I get parking. If I can park you close, you can stay in the car. Mm -hmm. I have to get potatoes and mangoes. How long will that be? Not that long. Excuse me, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. Would you like to come with me? Yeah, me too. Me too. Then you can. Lordy. So bad thing about this place, it's 50, uh, 50 cents no matter what. You don't get like 15 minutes free or anything. And I guess they're not doing security. The one guy is just letting everybody in. Fine by me. So here's Chow Patty. Chow Patty is slamming. Looks like a bag of you know what. However, that place is really good food. Amazing. Amazing. And what does everybody like to eat at Chow Patty? I know chicken. You chips. Like, you like, yes. You like chicken and chips? And, and bajillas. And bajillas. And hot dogs. They don't have hot dogs there, you little tato. It's Indian food. It's Indian food. Uh, what do you like eating there, Mir? Palak Paneer. Palak So chips. these are all little shops inside there. And I want them yama. And then on the other side of the stairs over there, that's where we get onion bajillas. And I don't like onions. I think onions are like, they're not my thing. And onion bajillas are awesome. They're so good. I don't know what they do to it, but those are some onions I could eat. More little shops. We are going to corner shop, which is in the corner. Kids, I think you guys might be able to sit in the car. Look where we're gonna park. I'll park here. That is corner shop. Yeah. Why is it a corner shop? Because it's in the corner, dude. It's not called fruit basket shop. It's called corner shop. Boys, come. Choppity, choppity. Okay, we need. Um, oh, broccoli would be great. Let's get broccoli too. I don't think. I don't, hi, how are you? Could, could it, yes, please. Go look if you see them. Hi, how are you? Could you give me a 15 kilo potato? Which ones? Just the regular ones. Yeah, white sour. Thank you, thank you. The music is very. Pardon me? Oh, you need help with the strawberries. A peanuts. Love my peanuts. Oh, mangoes. I need mangoes too. What? Oh, they're this side. Let's look. A nice one, honey. Here, take. Would you like raspberries, Mir? You're not eating them in the car. And cheese for that. Cheese Not from here. We're going to go to the other cheese shop. Okay? Great. And then we need mango. Oh, look at these ones. What are these called? Anybody know? Can we eat them? Are they dragon fruit? Is that what they're called? Do you think it is? I mean, I don't want to make a mistake in front of a bunch of I always make mistakes in front of a bunch of yeah, people. So. What are these ones called? Soke soke. Soke soke. Yeah, right, it's name. Uh-huh. 
just open uh -huh. to beat the inside part. Oh, not the outside part. No, yeah, not the outside. And are they ripe or they're not ripe? Yeah, normally this reddish one are ripe. Okay. Yeah. There's more. Okay. Sweet. It's sweet? And how much are they for like this much? This one per kg. Oh, how much per kg? It is uh, for night. Oh, that's not bad. Okay. If you are to take this. Yeah, that's fine. I need a lot though. Oh, well, isn't that interesting? I guess we should try those. No, oh, no, I'm confused. Okay, hold it. I don't know which one to take. Take this one. Put that one down. Yeah, this one. Put that one down. Take this one. That's that's for somebody. What? Oh, do you want small bananas, Mia? While we're here. Yeah. Small bananas. Small yeah. bananas. Well, what did I say? Jiminy cricket. Here. Oh, you're having raspberries and bananas. Yeah. Okay, fine. Now, who wants to? Everybody has something, right? Okay, great. Yeah, crazy town. Now we need mango. Mango. I know we're gonna get mango. No. The bags are so tiny, though. For us little piggies. Mangoes. Don't know how much they are. The trick is, it, they, it just shows you on your receipt how <laughs> much you paid for everything. Sure, is that, that's not our cart actually. To be honest, I don't know where our cart is. Let's mango up. What do I know? I think our cart's on this other side. Um, nobody's leaving you, honey. Let's go like this. Yep, that's ours. You want to put your strawberries inside, honey? Okay, that's good. Okay, that's fine. Even that's a, that's okay. A good amount. I don't mind. That amount is okay. This one. Yeah. We'll eat that. Do you think it's about 15? Yeah, I think. Yes, that was it. We're just going to eat it. And then mangoes, I also need like a few, like a bag. Yeah. Mixed, yeah? What is that? My little sprite? Oh, do we want broccoli? I like broccoli. I like broccoli. Sorry, sorry. What, what, what? What are these things? Broccoli. Well, this is not a place for choco pillows, by the way. Watch your toes. Those are pilly pilly. Some broccoli. Some should be ripe and some not ripe, yeah? Like a nice mix. Sour. Thank you. Okay, let's go this way, kids. Uh, Ollie, back up. Nate, Nate, back up. Nate, Nate, back up. Nate, Nate, back up. Nate, Nate's in the car car. Nate, Nate, no feel naughty. What else do you think we needed? What did I say? I said mangoes and potatoes, right? Okay, so we're good. Don't open it. Dude, stop it. Okay, let's do a little tour while we wait for mango. Apples, pears, a boy in my way, back up, back up, back up. watermelons. You go this way then, you can't, Oliver, Oliver, you cannot be on the camera, okay? This is not for home, this is for public. That's papaya or pow pow, nanners, cantaloupes, 
passion fruit. Limes, limes. I really like, my mother-in-law makes boiled peanuts. They're so good. I don't know how to do it. Yeah, that'll be great. Why are you buying peanuts? Because I really like them. How much are the peanuts? Okay, two, three hundred. Okay. So give me one of those. Maybe my lady knows how to cook them. But she boils them with salt. Oh, they're so good. I think that's it now. Yeah. That is it. Okay, back up, kids. There's so much. So much goodness. Okay, so let me pay. So now, got to pay parking. I don't think there's onion bajillas yet, but we're going to check. It's like super dodgy, right? <laughs> it's delicious. Yeah, nothing yet. That's where my onion bajillas live. Delicious. But they don't have. So that's the end of that. We pay parking. And we go back. This is where we queue to pay parking. I'll be back. Ugh. Too many hands. Where you get me? Key put away. Aye! You see? Oh, you didn't see that. Anyway, that car just would hit that lady. This parking lot's crazy. People don't drive right. Anyway, potatoes. We said 15 kilos. I asked for 15 kilos. And he was gonna weigh it, and I was like, no, it looks fine, just give me that. And he, what I mean, it was his choice, not mine. But anyway, 15.075 kgs. He just winged it. Two gro He's like, yeah, that's about 15. Isn't that amazing? Anyway, potatoes are 79 cents a kilo. And apple mangoes are $1.19 a kilo. My peanuts were three dollars a kilo, and I got half a kilo, so it was a buck sixty-six from a bag of peanuts. Strawberries were a buck seventy-nine for that punnet or punnet. Raspberries were three bucks. Rambutan, those were those prickly things. That was a buck forty. Red mangoes are ninety-nine cents a kilo, and baby bananas are a dollar thirty-nine a kilo. So. That is good trivia. So I got all that groceries for $29.38. Moving on. Oh, come on. Are you guys doing rock, paper, rock, paper scissors? Oh, come on. Oh, wow. I'm almost oh, letting me go. Oh. How polite. Walk away. <laughs> how scary. Motorbikes, how scary. Oh, oh, you did a tie. No, I didn't tie. So you did scissors and then you changed to rock, so I won. Now we are on our way to Royal Snacks to get cheese. 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 We did not get cheese. Cheese. What motorcycle? Oh, do you want to get paneer? Mmm. You're over paneer? I want chili paneer. Huh? I want chili paneer. I don't really want. I want pizza. I want it. That's a surprise. Yeah, why do you like uh -huh. pizza all the time? Now this intersection, yeah. I tell you. It's my least favorite. So because the name of the game is to block the intersection. It's like, oh, look who blocked it. Like literally. It's insanity. Say uh -huh. ah, We did it. It wasn't so bad. All over one. Ah. It's worse later in the day. Medical clinic. Interesting. Opticians. Indian Chinese barbecue. Never knew about that. Fireworks sold here. Fireworks. Who likes fireworks? Me. Mm. But those look well quality. You can't even see them. Oh, you just don't like the sign. I don't like the sign. We buy from a temple before, like at Diwali. There's like one week where they open up a big. What? A uh, meeting room where you can go in and buy. It's like a giant stadium. It's, like a giant stadium. it's massive, and they, and then have, they have so like many. Mortar fireworks, and they like shoot in the air, and then it lands at the neighbor's house. It, they go really far. Like really far, and then I made a magic sword. Mortar. Yeah. 
Oh, I forgot to turn. I. That was Royal Snacks. Okay, now I gotta turn. I have to turn. I gotta burn a U. Somehow. <laughs> Scenic tour of the neighborhood. I don't like these. I don't know where these roads go. Take care. Well, I know where this one goes, but. Oh, that looks sensible on this side, doesn't it? Yeah. Sure it does. Hold on, cats! Whoa! Whoa. Hi here! No, let me wipe the wrong way. That's a fun sound, right? And school. This is not school. That's an apartment block. This is, yeah, I can see you, Dodos. Dodos. Today I'm the dodos. I'm the dodos. <laughs> I'm the dodos that didn't turn. Okay, G2G. Mom, G2G. Here yeah, we gotta turn. Every day and they have mozzarella, but that brand. And that it's like 25% less. Oh, okay. So I will come here for. I missed it again. Oh my gosh. This is not good. <laughs> I've never come from this side. I'm like, that's my chemist. Okay, let's turn around again. And we'll find another place for turning. Road trip. Oops, like this one. Oh, this Road might not be that good either. Mommy well, we just stands here. I know, but look what mommy's gonna do now. More crazy shenanigans. I know, honey pot. Okay. Now, returning appropriately. Third time's the charm. Okay, after Ridge Court, there's a good pharmacy in there. Right here, the tiny little sign. This is where we're going. That's where we're going, Royal Snacks. Clearly, difficult to miss, right? They have snacks here, though? Yes, Mir, did you want to come in? But what kind of snacks do they have? They have all the snacks. Like some chips? Yes, yes. This is where they make it. And now it's in there, not at the back where it was the last time, but before it used to be back there. That's a cow pow tree. Can we go? Do they have crackles? Mir, it's homemade. It's the better kind, like grandma sends us. Can we come? Where's Wade? All right, we need bags. Let me take a bag. There's my bags. Okay, back up. Back up, child. Gosh, that's heavy. Ooh, okay, let's go this way. Yeah, how many? Oh, banana over there too. Okay, Royal Snacks. Well, come on in. Karibu, Cody. Oh, Suntop, who likes that? Me. You guys. You're too lucky. What is it starting already? You want to do a little shopping? <laughs> what would you like? So how many items can I choose? Zero. Oh, what's happening down here? What? Can you back up? Can you back up? Can you back up? What would you like? You have to. You have to negotiate. Ooh, paneers, twenty percent off. Do it, dude. Love it. So this paneer is awesome, and it's like eight dollars, I think, for a kilo. But now it's even less. I will take two. Yum. Every day for dad. That's dad's best. Mozzarella for pizza. I take two. Ah, it's heavy. Can I make an appeal? Yeah, you can make an appeal. I'm not going to agree. No. Why are we having soda? We have soda at home. I know it's Mountain Dew. I don't, let me listen to someone else's. Pardon me? Let's go see what's on this side. Oh, who likes hobnobs? What? 
You wanna? Oh, you found hula hoops. What? What? Wait, yeah. Ooh. Huh? Oh, that's cute. 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 Oh, 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 the penny for you. You can buy them here. You guys are rattling too much. Oh, here's our crisps. Mom, I thought you were going to cake. You want the banana, the banana ones? The long kind. Okay, let's get banana. Banana crisps. Great. Okay, let's go. That's it. That's it. You have hula hoops. Dude. Jiminy. Okay. Arrowroot crisp, cassava, banana short. Banana short. Chocolate. Chocolate. Okay, now let's pay. So that stop. I got obviously snacks for the kids because I'm a sucker. I don't know how big this bag is. Oops, dropped my car key. This was $4.50 for a pound of banana crisps. Crisps, my kids call them crisps. And a serum on cheese, I got five kilos. So all that was $60.59.50. Kids are eating. So we have a moment. Jason, go ahead. This lady is on her phone. She's not looking. She almost walked into my car. So you can hire these push carts to push your stuff around for, uh, I don't know, a $4 or $5, depending on where you're taking your stuff to. Apparently they make really good money. It's like a really good business. Who knew? Not me. So now we are going to Two Rivers. This is still Parklands. That used to be a Chanarana in there. I don't know if it still is. Like a food plus. Really weird one though. Like they didn't have anything that... I don't know. This is really weird. Not my scene. Straight ahead is Aga Khan, a really good and nice hospital. I was born there. Mira was born there, yeah. Let me see. Whoops, guess that was a bump. Very interesting. Now I'm trying to get onto the bypass. <laughs> Let's see how successful we'll be. Oh, straight up begging, that's not bad. Usually there's a guy pretending to be blind and then they switch day to day of who's blind and who's holding his hand. New building? Really, fake business. Yeah, fake news, fake business. So if you guys visit Kenya, get fake news. Yeah. Just tell them open your eyes. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, motorbike. I should have just gone like you and you randomly six. gone out there. You're fine. Okay, great. Thanks, everybody. I'm too polite in Parklands. It just freaks me out. There's like so many cars and ugh, I don't like it, but just got to pull out. But I think at the end of this road, we can turn and technically we should be on the bypass if the world is aligned. Oh, I think this used to be spice routes on this road. Is it? What? Spice routes. We used to go there when you were a baby. But then it changed and it wasn't so good, but it used to be just delicious. Take it, that's how you're supposed to drive in park clothes. Okay, you need to wait. Wait, I'm still gonna hit my car. That was the second we could drive hey, a lot. Look at me. Really? Yeah. Hey mom, look at this. What do you got, dude? Look. I can't see, I'm driving. Has rings. Oh, you got rings. Oh, you got rings on your fingers? Yeah. Cool. I bet you they're delicious. Maybe this isn't spice roots, maybe it is. Oh, this is so confusing. 
Yeah, I think it, that used to be spice roots. Yeah, it did. <laughs> Not even lost. Hey! And I think this is kind of a bypass, or I have to still go over one. I think. Mm, I'll give you a I think I can do it. Bicyclist. Yeah, yeah. Bouncy castle! What? Oh yeah, there's a bouncy castle. Good eye, Ollie. What are we getting a care for, kids? Bouncy castle. We're not bouncy getting, getting a bouncy castle. castle. <laughs> <laughs> no. Two cereal. Okay. Go ahead, pass. I'm totally going slow. You're right. And then that's it. That's it. That's a, that's, oh yeah, we need bread as well. We need bread. We could use some of those pizza crusts if you felt like it. Or I think Katrina might have made us pizza yeah. crusts. Yeah. 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 Are you sure? Yeah. Oh, we need tin foil yeah. for the pizza crusts. Yeah, here's the bypass. This is the action. This is what I'm looking for. But I got to get over on. Oh, it's not so busy. Okay, everybody. Let's get along. Let's get along. Let's get along. You're not even in my lane. Great. Perfect. Then. Thank you. Nerve wracking. Now I think I have to stay up and I think I'm in a lane. Not that you can tell. But I'm pretty sure. Yeah, look, there's paint starting. Nailed it. Totally in a lane. Okay, now we go until we get to the next bypass. So I guess there's like Southern Bypass, Eastern Bypass. There's all these bypasses. West bypass. I don't think there's a West. Over there is Gara, like far. It's also a ditch. That's where you can get those really cool African fabrics. I mean, it's not it's not the right neighborhood for us. Temple. Temple again. Okay. You're like, yeah, I know where you are. I've been on this road. Uh, soccer. Do you say soccer? Soccer. You don't call it football. Soccer. American style, British call it football. Well, can you take me? Can you take me there? Can I take you there? Yeah. To soccer. Yeah. One day. Let's just yeah. stay in the middle. Oh, there's traffic going the other way. Suckers. Oh, and then on the left here they put speed bumps or something. It's so silly. Yeah. Now I I think I can stay in this lane. I also think I want to get over one. That wasn't hurt. Meet me. And yes, nobody gets my roadrunner jokes. That is only me in my little head. I think it's funny. Do we have drinks on the list? No, because Dad got us sodas. How many sodas do we have? Too many. We don't need drinks. I was thinking of getting Dad some bottled water. Why? Because he drinks it. And I think... Oh no, I stay on this one now, way. Right? I'm supposed to go left if we're going into Mathaiga, but we're not. Yeah, we have drinks on the list, honey. I'm on finish. Okay, well that's it. I'm glad you liked it. When you get home... What are we having? I thought we're having. I thought we're having. I want to have hot dogs for lunch. Yeah. Yeah. Hot dogs. 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 Yep. Super. What is this guy doing? Always turning. That's nice. That's good. It's great. If you mess up that little road there, apparently you can get back onto the big highway. Or if you've messed up and gone onto the big highway, you can use that little road to get back over here. Oh look, there's traffic all the way. Ollie! You're too loud, dude! Because I love louder. I know you love louders. I know. It's not my best. Look at these guys driving like crazy. Driving like, like nutty. Like Those houses over there, I don't know if you can see or can't see them anymore, I don't think. But anyway, they a few years ago, five, ten years ago, they were selling those houses, or one house over there was for sale saying that it's Mathaiga, the Golf and Country Club area. I'm like, what? 
Maybe not. Maybe that is just right beside a busy road in a little bit of a ditch. Masaiga, for those of you who have not watched my previous out and about, is like a super snotty neighborhood. I think it's the snottiest neighborhood in Kenya. Like the president and like everybody. People live there. Like houses are, like if you're gonna rent a house there, it's like 15 to $20,000 a month. For 5,000, you basically have a cabin. But you do get to say, I live in Mathaga. Yeah, by the cloak. Well, I'm like, that house in the ditch is not Mathaga. What? Oh, isn't that nice lady up there? Why is he doing I think she's dancing. What does it say? Stay classic? Or no? Sassy, sassy classic? Sassy classic. It says what? Sexy classic. Okay. I was hoping that was wrong, but I guess not. Look at that place. Army. How individual. That's right. It is individual. Let's get, get the lady. Get the lady. It's Art Mirror. Sony classic. Sony, you're you're hearing things, Mir. What? Where's your brain at? I don't know. Are you almost a teenager or what? Anyway, 